What's up everyone from Seaf Music? I'm in Legend, I'm in the middle of recording for you guys and just recording some covers. And as I'm finishing, I what I like to do is I like to practice what I'm going to play. And literally, as I'm coming to the end of practicing one of the songs, I then look down and realize there's a hole in my bass drum. <laughs> I don't think to myself, no. Because uh, literally what's happened is over time, uh, my beta has come loose and it slowly started turning and angling itself. So instead of actually the beta, the felt side hitting the drum, it started to have like the actual container of the head. I can't like, oh, to help describe it to you, you know what I'll do? I'm going to quickly just pop off. Uh, so since this is a double bass drum pedal, I don't know if you can still see me right now, but yeah. So here is what my beta looks like, okay? So I just popped off one side, and this is the side that I play with. Yeah, there's barely been anything happened to that. But yeah, this is the side that I play with. And essentially what's happened is, it's hitting the bass drum like that, of course, yeah? And what happened was, over time I didn't realize, but it was angling this way. So it's been like playing with a corner, going into the bass drum, which has caused it to bust. And I just said, damn, like, I can't replace the head now, uh, so I'm going to order a new head after doing some recording. But I just wanted to show you what I've done, uh, just to keep things going. Uh, I've had to resort to tape, which I'll show you in a bit. So, so as you guys can see, this is what I've resorted to to uh, stop the problem. But then again, when I look at it, I've had, I've had these heads how long now? maybe two years and that's two years of consistent like drumming on a daily or like every other day basis and i just thought to myself you know what okay cool cool maybe it's uh, i'm definitely gonna replace this head don't worry about that but yeah this is my safety measure and fortunately this is obviously phone audio still good thank you remo for Equipment that still holds up, still holds up. Even after, like literally, I taped it before thinking about doing this video. Like this video is just a spare of the moment thing. So I think I'm going to title this like how to repair heads or make shit. I'll come up with something. But yeah, this is what I've done. I've just taped the entire thing uh, just to make sure it's at least manageable until I get a new head. So... As you guys can see, that's just a little quick video. I'm gonna get back to doing some covers, but I just thought, you know what, whilst it's there, I have no idea if I'm even gonna ever upload this, but I figured, you know what, let me just take that moment. So that's how you can recover your bass drum. Please be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Trust me, hit me up with those video suggestions, anything, help me out. And remember, spread the word. But until then, I'll see you next time. Take care of yourselves.